yourself to get up early and recite Nitnim when you keep falling asleep and can't concentrate on Nitnim, especially when you're the only one who does it and when your father gets drunk the night before and your mom argued with him all night long. They keep you awake. <laughs> if the parents are fighting, that means you are keep being kept awake. And as far as your personal uh, understanding of Amrita Vela is concerned, Amrita Vela is not for anybody. It is a very personal thing. The rule of the thumb is when the sun is 60 degrees this way and sun is 60 degrees this way, that time is called twilight zone. The twilight zone is from 4 a.m. to 7 a.m., 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. You find mostly people want to drink and do other things between 4 and 7 because the biorhythm of the body and energy and mental tiredness is so much if they do not have their prana shakti practiced they will be down the hill there's no substitute for it all those people who can take drugs have a shallow breath their breath is not deep they have not understood what Nanak said, Paman Guru, Pani, Pita, Mata, Dart, Mat. Their Paman Guru is not with them. Their Prananda Vahan, Pavana. Prananda Vahan, the messenger of the Prana, is not developed, not enlarged, and not understood. And they can't understand Paman, Paman, Par, Para, Par, Para, Paman Guru, Paman Guru, Vahe Guru, Vahe Guru, Paman Guru. They cannot understand the, within the finite, the scope and leap of the infinity to which they can reach and administer the strength from the infinite universe, infinite universe which is theirs. Therefore, they have to fall on worldly things. And one of the worldly things is the liquor, the other worldly thing is the drugs, the other worldly things is they need a buzz. I'm not denying. You need a buzz, that's true. But there's another buzz, which buzz, 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 buzz all the time. And that's the real buzz, which continues. Posat mad fim pang utra jaye prabhat naam khumari nanaka chadhi raya din raat. This is a science. Eko shabd nahi pad chadna. This is not a shabd which you must pronounce. This is a practical science in which people can get practical knowledge and practical strength. So, Rising at the ambrosial hour is also a Western thought. Early to bed, early to rise makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise. So if you want to be healthy, wealthy, and you want to be wise, you must get up early in the morning. Because at early in the morning, between 4 to 7, both nostrils start breathing. And that takes away your youth, that takes away your energy, that takes away everything of you. Whole day you are just a dumb cantaloupe. There's no head. I mean, it's true. Look at the biorhythm of those who get up and do it, and look at the biorhythm who don't. There's a difference between daylight and night. So, in the future world, when everything will be based on computer and dogma of information, person shall find so empty that they have to come and learn from us the science and to join us, otherwise they will be mental. So we are not absolutely worried. This bogus majority cannot tell us what to do. We have found the system, we have found the science, and we have found the way. And that's not for only Sikhs, that's for the entire humanity who wants to come to the house of the Guru irrespective of their caste, color, creed, and their nonsense. If they want to make sense, we shall be open doors serving them. Doesn't matter who is who, no charge. No condition, no restriction. So if you do not want to get up early in the morning, I give you my personal example. One day I didn't want to get up at all. Because I was very late, what? Huh? 
ਇਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਤਾਂ ਤੰਗ ਕਰ ਆਪਿਓ ਤੱਕੇ ਤੱਕੇ ਮਾਰ ਕੇ ਕਰ ਲੈਂਗੇ ਤੂੰ ਵਿੱਚ ਕਾ ਨੂੰ ਕਰਨਾ ਬਹਿ ਚੁੱਪ ਕਰਕੇ ਹੁਣ ਜਿੰਨੀ ਥਾਂ ਹੈ ਉਨਾ ਹੀ ਹੈ ਹੁਣ ਕਿਵੇਂ ਕਿ ਕਿੰਨਾ ਕੋ ਪੀੜੇਗਾ ਇਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਕੋਈ ਅਰਥ ਜਰੂਰ ਹੈ ਵੀ ਬਾਰਿਸ਼ ਵੀ ਹੁੰਦੀ ਹੈ ਫਿਰ ਨਾਲ ਇਹਨਾਂ ਦਾ ਰਸ ਕੱਢਣਾ ਸ਼ੁਰੂ ਕਰ ਦਈਏ ਠੀਕ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਜਿੰਨੇ ਵੀ ਆ ਜਾਓ ਵਿੱਚ ਵੜਵੜ ਜਾਓ ਰਹਿਮ ਰੂਮ ਕਰਕੇ ਇੱਕ ਦੂਜੇ ਨੂੰ ਥਾਂ ਥੂੰ ਦੇ ਦਿਓ ਗੋਡਾ ਚਾਇਆ ਸਿੰਘ ਬਾਇਆ ਕੁਝ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਇਹ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਚ ਤਾਂ ਕਿਹਾ ਕਿਸੇ ਨੂੰ ਸਮਝ ਲੱਗੇ ਅੱਗੇ ਚਲੋ ਹਾਂ ਸੋ ਗੱਲ ਇਹ ਹੈ ਥਿਸ ਇਜ਼ ਹਾਊ ਦੀ ਥਿੰਗਸ ਆਰ ਅਰਲੀ ਇਨ ਦੀ ਮਾਰਨਿੰਗ ਵਨ ਡੇ ਆਈ ਡਿਡ ਨਾਟ ਵਾਂਟ ਟੂ ਗੈਟ ਅਪ ਐਂਡ ਆਈ ਡਿਸਾਈਡਡ ਆਈ ਕੈਨ ਨਾਟ ਗੈਟ ਅਪ ਆਈ ਲੁਕਡ ਐਟ ਮਾਈ ਪਲਸ ਇਟ ਵਾਸ ਵੈਰੀ ਫਾਸਟ ਐਂਡ ਆਈ ਲੁਕ ਐਟ ਮਾਈ ਬਾਡੀ ਇਟ ਹੈਜ਼ ਅ ਹੈਵੀ ਟੈਂਪਰੇਚਰ ਰੀਲੀ ਗੁੱਡ ਵਨ ਐਕਸਕਿਊਜ਼ ਵਾਸ ਪਰਫੈਕਟ and sleeping was very nice and i couldn't get up so what i did is i put myself down and rolled to the bathroom and didn't change my clothes and i took the cold shower and unturned it well then it was a rain from heavens i do not after a few minutes i didn't have fever i didn't feel anything i got up then i did my every normal thing and dressed up normally and did my thing I thought to myself I don't want to get up. I really don't want to get up. And then I said to hell with it. I am going to get up. Doesn't matter. There's nothing is going to stop me. I am me. Not get up. When you start fighting with yourself, you shall win the god. mind is given to you as a servant not a master and it must tell you don't get up when it say don't get up you say i am going to devil shit 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 Shh, i'm getting up and then get up that's all it takes if you like this video click the like button and if you want to see more videos like this subscribe why we meditate and why we meditate with a mantra is a very simple question it has been applied many times when you meditate you lock your optical nerve 